Okay, so um, let's set some goals for today, I guess. I haven't had much time to do stuff, but I've been really trying to keep up with my reading and increase my reading speed. Yeah, and all of the um, the preparation you've been doing with the all your planning and stuff, that all counts as reading. Yeah. <laughs> What background information is implied in the first paragraph? I don't, I think it's the war between Athens and Crete is long running. Yeah. yeah. So can you find me some key information for that? Um, you should always check back, always link it back to the text. Yeah. Just to make sure, even when it's an easy one. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think it's the fact that a proposal had been made. Um, they were weary of the war, but it mm. didn't really hint the fact that I don't think Athens at all wanted to continue it because they wouldn't have followed through with mm -hmm. the bargain. Um, Minos definitely wouldn't have even made a bargain if he thought he was going well. He wouldn't oh, have really? made a bargain in favour of him if he thought he was going to lose the war, he'd want Athens to like Athens to kind of gain out of the bargain in a mm. sense, because Athens isn't gaining anything other than peace. Except by that the, yeah, the war. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, but it's mainly the weariness of war. So you'd yeah. expect that it's a long time. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty heavy. Hey. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> really good reading. So you've actually warmed up now. I think you've been feeling much better about your reading. <laughs> yeah, it takes me a little bit. Once I'm warmed up, I'm okay. <laughs> um, it's obvious. <laughs> <laughs> so the question is, this is this text is an extract from a report on child literacy. Select the best subheading to cover paragraphs three and four. So one, two, three. I like the title of Fighting the Subculture of Underachievement. Okay. And does it match the two paragraphs? Yeah. I think it does summarise it to an extent that we need to reconsider how we're viewing underachievement and that it is a culture that we can't always control, but we need to still try and work against it. Yes. Yeah. So, and it does talk about how there's powerful forces largely beyond the control of teachers and yeah it's an inverse culture yeah and if yeah. you're too successful then that's yeah. bad not good yeah which is a definitely a cultural view yeah definitely okay okay um this is why i don't touch type i should learn how to touch type <laughs> i was taught in grade six how to touch type and it was the best thing i have ever done really but it does that's awesome it it creeps some people out when I'm at uni and the lecturer is talking and I don't drop eye contact. Yeah. And I'm just sitting there typing away, not making any errors or anything. My husband can do that. All right. Well, I guess I will see you again soon. Yeah? Yes. All right. Nice Thank to see you, you again. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.